Up to Speed, a recurring program keeping you up to speed on the arts and entertainment happenings here in Albuquerque and beyond. On this week's show, episode one, we've got Denny the Harp, local music legend. Don't forget to stay tuned for Brian Schoner of Wagogo and other acts. And our feature interview today will be with Chris Brennan of Reviva, speaking about their brand new music video, Take Me Away. I'm Nick A. Myers, you're tuned in, and we're getting you up to speed. Up to speed. Up to speed. Up to speed. So, our first guest, this is Mr. Danny the Hart, was a local Albuquerque music legend, and the two of us are hanging out right here at Rio Bravo Brewing Company uh, in Albuquerque. So, tell us a little bit about um, what you're doing tonight. Well, Mr. Myers, tonight I'm going to be playing with Brian Schoner Trio. Amazing jazz, kind of like uh, the jazz hip hop type of stuff that came out. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. And so this is what we're doing tonight is Real Bravo has a weekly spotlight called Loungy Wednesdays. So shout out Mariposa Music for that. They're showcasing artists in a, in a different setting. So tonight we're having a lot of fun. We're about to get started. It's early, but it's 6 to 8 every week. Now back to Danny. Danny, you play in a number of different bands. You're one of the coolest dudes I know. You play every instrument. I've seen you. I've seen you scuba dive while playing a harpsichord and talk to mermaids. So just don't ask me to chew gum at the same time. No, he can't do that. He's not really allowed either. Uh, they took it away from him in school. It's kind of weird. Tell us what brought you into music briefly, and like what keeps you drawn into playing, and being a part of so much of the spectrum of music, musicianship. I'm glad you asked that, Nick. When I was in college, pre-med and stuff, I just wasn't really fulfilled, so I started to play on the open mics and stuff. It's about ten years back. And I decided to turn pro, that is not professional in the sense that I'm the best musician there is, but rather rely upon it as my It's an income. Yeah, you, you're a paid musician. You gig and get paid. Right. At least I hope. At least I hope. We try. And name a few of the things that you, I mean, that you play that you dabble in as far as instruments go. So harmonica is how I got my nickname, Danny the Harp from his band La Junto. He used to have Danny Hart. Shout out to him. He's got great dead products out there. Love you, Danny. La Junta started out with them. I'm playing tonight with Brian Schoenert. I have my own trio. I'm playing with this band String Dinner. They're kind of bluegrass bands. So I've done a lot of reggae here in town. We used to play with the Viva. And basically, I'm, I'm for hire. For, he's for hire. He plays keys. He plays the bass. I'm pretty sure he plays the guitar because I and played with him. Stand and he plays stand up. Electric. I mean, I, I bet you could probably learn how to play like the Zuzaphone or, you know, even like play it, a man. marimba. Can you play it, bro? Can you play a marimba? Yeah, with my hands, dude. He's actually been marimbaized by a, a marimbist, so he can do it. Uh, I, I've seen you percuss. I do percuss. And I've seen him, and, I, and I, that's one thing I respect about Albuquerque is there's a lot of, there's not a lot, but there are people like Danny who are just, just guys like Renaissance guys, um, and doing it all and continuing to make music a part of their soul. So we appreciate you. Don't yeah, stop yeah, doing yeah. you, man. I appreciate you too. So man. leading into or leaving us to go tonight. Tell us what you got going on for 2018, D. Mr. 2018, Hart. hopefully I'm playing in your band. If you need a bassist, I, uh, that's right. Right, right. electric. You need a keyboard player. You need a harmonic player, guitar. You need somebody to sing. Do background vocals. Get a hold of me, Danny the Harp on Facebook, all over on social media, etc. I love you guys. Bless. Come on down to Loungy Wednesdays, enjoy a beer here at Real Bravo Brewing Company. We look forward to seeing you soon. Up to speed! Yes. Thank you. This is Mr. Chris Brennan from Reviva. What's up, Chris? Happy to be here with you, Danny. Thank you for coming, man. We've known each other a long time, man. We have, and we have a lot of respect for, uh, I have a lot of respect for your band and what you do as a community organizer. Um, one of the reasons we're here today is to talk about, we have a new album out called Equanimity. Tell us a quick bit about that album. Sure, we're really excited about it. You know, we recorded it uh, in 2017, and it's just, we just uh, are about to release our first music video ever. Uh, take Me Away, and it's dealing with uh, support of the diversity that we have here in our country, in our state, uh, and you know, in support of the DREAM Act and trying to get uh, more support for DACA and, and in general just you know, to help, help diversity and all the immigrants and refugees who help our country. Yeah. That's beautifully said, and it's the truth. I mean, we really need to, to, to look at the realities before we kind of make snap judgments. Videos like this, uh, I think, can help raise awareness, and that's appreciated, man. We really. And now, right now, we're we're hanging out at Dual Brewery downtown Albuquerque, which is one of our favorite spots to have a brew. Um, and have you guys played here yet? We have. We played a couple times. You know, we had uh, most recently our producer Pablo Stenic, uh came out to, for a show, and we had a really good. Google time. that guy. I'm sorry to interrupt, but Google yeah, that. He's, Google he's Pablo. Five-time Grammy winner, great guy, and. Uh, we're going to be back here on the 14th for the video premiere Sunday, January 14th, and Revivo will be playing from 4 to 6 p.m., and then uh, right right around 6, we're going to release the, the video upstairs in the secret 
VIP room with Alex Paramos got it. Of course. Uh, my pops, John Brennan, and Sarah Brennan have done a lot of work, so I want to thank them. And big ups, to, big ups to your family, too. I've always had a lot of respect for them. This episode of Up to Speed is brought to you by Dual Brewery, a Belgian-style brewery, located downtown Albuquerque at 606 Central and in Santa Fe. Also brought to you by Rio Bravo Brewing Company, serving up family tradition to the community, located at 1912 2nd Street Northwest in Albuquerque. Speaking of Monty Plus and music and, and community publishing, I hear you guys have a famous actress in your video. So sure. Tell us a little bit more about, about her. Sure. So Alex's daughter, Marisol, uh, both him and, and, and Marisol's mother have done a great job raising her. So she's uh, very multi-talented and she's the star of our music video and it really portrays uh, what happens when you separate families. You know, I, I just saw a commercial or a, a video, I didn't realize that 99% of Americans were either immigrants or descendants of immigrants. So that's a good fact to know. And think about that make it, while making America think great again. How we, we contribute to uh, So, I'm uh, sorry to interrupt, but so, so looking back at your year in music, um, you know, you, you had a pretty successful album release. This is Raviva's third album? This is, this is our third album, so we had an EP that was short, and uh, you know, for us, the first uh, albums were all produced here, so we wanted to, to come back. We did it at Central Root, which I know you know, Giles and Mike Gerdes from Central Root, and they do a really good job. But uh, the coolest, one of the coolest parts is that we involved uh, and invited so many New Mexican musicians. So there's a lot of people, Mooney, uh, from, from Mooney to Delmon. Uh, to Tony Arant, who plays on the keys, all kinds of local great musicians, uh, just doing a really great job. You know, we had cool. great violinists, uh, the young ladies, the backup singers, and it's, it was a special collaboration. That uh, that is what music's about. I think that's one thing we can agree on: is our music tastes or what we're doing may differ. We also have the same core values that we do have a community component, and I've always respected that about your approach to music. It's a teaching component. It brings people together, and it can also be fun. You know, a lot sure, of sure. a lot of good vibes. We're, we accept people from everywhere. You're from Michigan. Right? I'm from Illinois. Close enough. Illinois, close enough. Right. But this is you know, New Mexico brings everyone out. I've been here most of my life, as I know you've grown up here. So. Look, if you, if you haven't checked out Revivo, they're amazing. Got to give them a shot. Um, you can also see the video, Take Me Away, down at Dual Brewery um, on January 14th. And it'll be on YouTube after that. Everything no, just one. That's it. Just one screening and it's <laughs> done. For now, you're listening to Up to Speed. I'm Nick A. Myers, and such a great pleasure to be here. Thank you, Chris oh, thank Brennan. Thank you, brother. You're the man. We'll catch you next time. Respect. Thank you. Up to Speed. Our guest is Mr. Brian Schoenert. Hello, Brian. Uh, musician extraordinaire, plays with the super awesome band Reviva, but he also is very talented on his own. You're here tonight at, uh, we're here at Loungy Wednesdays at Real Bravo, Big Ups on the Beer, and you're playing tonight, right? Who are you playing with? What's going on, man? I'm playing with Danny the Harp, classic musician out in Albuquerque, New Mexico for a long time, and Eden Cruz from Puerto Rico, uh, he's a great drum set player, we're just putting together a little trio. Beautiful. Original music. I love original music. You, you do a little bit of, um, you play a little bit of everything. I've seen you go, man. You're like a wizard. Um, and I know uh, the Loungy Wednesdays is happening every Wednesday at Rio Bravo, but you're also um, into playing big stages. You play with Revivo. What's the last one of the last big things you guys did, or something that you're more memorable from 2017? Uh, we played at the Sunshine. We opened for uh, Sir Sly and Dirty Heads, and it was. Uh, it was a packed venue full of people. I've never really seen or view it before. And, uh, Goosebumps, I bet. It was pretty, uh, it's, it's hard to come down from that, but it's good. Well, it's good experience. So again, if you want to find out what's going on in the local art scene, local music scene, Up to Speed is going to be coming out every Wednesday, and you can find out more. It's brought to you by, of course, Career Styles Entertainment in association with Mariposa Music. And I'm Nick A. Myers. I'll be your host, and I'll be walking you through, you know, a lot of fun stuff. We're here with Brian Schoenert, our guest tonight, down here at Loungy Wednesdays. And before I let you go, because you're about to play, uh, six to eight is when that happens every Wednesday. But tell me one or two of your influences, uh, post 1950. No, I'm kidding. Uh, one or two of your musical influences, or even just one. I mean, something that really stands out to you as an influence. Um, well, there, there's like obviously a lot of influences uh, that we all have. Uh, but one band that sort of influenced me uh, initially, well, a couple. One, one was the Fugees. 
but another one would be uh, Kaye Kabese. And Evan, our drummer from today, uh, for today, actually has met a lot of those musicians because wow. he's from Puerto Rico. So he's my one degree of separation. That's awesome. Kaye Kabese and Cultura Profetica, which were two bands that I used to listen to. Are they both from Cuba? They're from Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico, they're both from Puerto Rico. Yeah, that's great. Up to speed. Up to speed. Up to speed.